Hey everyone, this is a quick tutorial video on how to restore your Windows 7 computer to factory settings without using a CD. Um, basically, the screen that I got to here is um, just advanced options for Windows 7. You get to this screen by booting up and right at the beginning where you have this screen continually hit F8 until this screen comes up and then go ahead and click enter for repair your computer it'll go through a series of screens here This is the system recovery options. Go ahead and click next. And then if you have a password or anything like that for your username or anything, go ahead and type that in and put in your password. Click OK. Then you'll come to this screen. You'll have a several different options. Go ahead and click Tosh or your recovery wizard. This is for a Toshiba, but it's pretty standard all the way around. Alright, then you have this. When the recovery is executed, all data will be deleted and rewritten. If you're restoring from a backup, did you make sure that your backup, all important data, and configure Windows the way you want it to be restored? Go ahead and attack, uh, connect your AC adapter. Click yes. And then here you go. Recovery of factory default software. Recover to out of state box. Go ahead and click next. Recover to out of state box, out of box state. And then just follow the prompts through here. Are you sure you want to continue? Go ahead and click yes or next. I noticed that I had this issue whenever I went into control print panel and tried to recover um, or restore it, my computer that way and it required a, a CD for Windows 7 so I couldn't I couldn't restore it to factory settings after doing some research I found this way and it has worked perfectly so I figured I would go ahead and post this video to help you guys out uh, please leave any comments or anything all right, if you have any questions, I'll try to get back to them as soon as I can. This does take some time, so plan for, you know, a little bit while you're doing this. This, is, this isn't really a quick process.
We've got a new screen here that says copying files, please wait. And then it says now recovering and then you just follow this all the way through any kind of prompts that you get you just keep clicking next and that's your factory restore. I hope this video works out for you and like I said leave some comments if you have any questions I'll try to get back to them whenever I get a second. Enjoy.